Hello, welcome to my first hair topic of 2014. I know it's been such a long time since I've had a hair topic, but this topic kind of fell into my lap because somebody asked me, why do I change my hair products in my routine so often? My answer to that would be, think about every aspect of your life. You change your hairstyles, you change your clothes, you change the style of clothes, you change what you eat, you change your bodily sense, your lotions, and all of that. So why wouldn't you change the products that you use in your hair and why wouldn't you change the technique in which you do your hair? So that was that's my short answer for that. And here's my reasoning for that. My reasoning is this. Things that worked for me when I big chopped or I went through my awkward phase or even the length of hair I have now or products I used six months ago don't necessarily work the way they do now as they did back then. Products that moisturized my hair initially may not moisturize the way it does now. I Like example, I used to love Shea Moisture's uh, coconut and hibiscus line. Now I use it, I get white beads in my hair, my hair ends up dry and hard and at times brittle because it has a lot of protein in it and my hair didn't need so much protein in it anymore because I basically got the type of strength and everything that I needed so I kind of tapped out protein wise. So that product line just wasn't working for my hair anymore, it wasn't defining curls like it used to so of course I switched up my products. Same with my oils. So, like in the beginning, I was using castor oil and I was using olive oil because my hair was so dry because I was just experimenting with my hair. Now my hair actually maintains moisture very well, so I switched my oils from olive oil to grapeseed oil. And I played with jojoba oil and sweet almond oil and it's, it's kind of fun. You get to see how your hair reacts to one product compared to another. And usually with my experimenting of products, my initial is just awesome. It My hair feels as though it's come back to life because it's like, oh my gosh, I have something new in my hair. She's done something out of the ordinary and that's just with anything in life you have to change your routines you have to change the things you use in your products and same goes with my routine I currently found a new routine for my hair it fell on my lap just like almost everything else in life it fell right in my lap and my curls are popping my hair is moisturized and I, I, I'm gonna start spending less time manipulating my hair and putting my fingers through my hair and I'm getting less frizz and I think it was a routine that my hair actually needed at this moment and I'll make another video on how I'm currently washing and conditioning and styling my hair I think I'm gonna stay with the wash and go for a while but like I said Different products, gr products grow on you. Your hair gets tired of the same products. It gets tired of the same routine. And after a while, you'll realize that your hair isn't reacting to what you're doing the way it used to. So you switch it up, you experiment again, you, you just throw out all the rules and you figure out what works for you. So that's my extended answer to that question. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys next time, all right? Bye.